What's up everyone, Dex from the Galactic Carrier, and today we open up my trades from Raven. This should be the last video that you see of physical trading cards until October. But I will be doing more deck test videos and deck um like deck test videos of decks that I'm working on or playing at the time on my computer until I get back in October. So yeah. Um it's gonna be a really quick video because I got a friend come pick me up soon to play Vanguard. So yeah, it should be a really quick and um opening. Well not really open but like review. So the first thing we got is Machine King Prototype. A Labyrinth Tank, which is super awesome. I really want this card for whatever reason. Got a but uh, kind of beat up Buster Blade, but that was perfect fun by me. It's hollow. Got a cool Sinister Serpent. And we got a Levive, uh, Levio Dragon Daedalus, which I like Daedalus. I believe I plan on bringing a deck with, Daedal with this card. I don't know what I'm doing with it yet, but I do plan on bringing a some type of deck with it. Next um, thing. Oh, we got Pyramid Light for my friend. Along with some Sphinx stuff. Super awesome. So I'll put that back in the sleeve so I can get it out to him tomorrow at work. Super awesome. Next, we got something. So we got a Metamorph, Metamorphosis, a Diamond Core Quakimiru. Got two of them. Seven to the Bandit and a Sakura 2 Armor. Super awesome. Next, we got a Bahamut Shark, which I needed for T Elements. Got a Symphonic Warrior Rocks, a Crawler Soma, a I'm um, Dragon Level 5, and a Swords or Villain Light. Super awesome. I do need this for my T Element deck. Super awesome. I think I'm missing Toad now, which I kind of felt bad because I traded my Toad off to somebody else before T Elements got, I think before T Elements came out, I think. Or when they got an or something. I don't remember. Got a dark. Got another dark. Another dark. Got like what? Five? One, two, three, four, five. This yeah, yeah, six copies of dark. Awesome. Going to my charmer. Going to my um charmer collection. Next we got one of my favorite um insect cards of all time. Armored B. Super cute. Got a Rika Princess, which I do need for my Rika deck. Monster Reborn, super awesome to have. Hit Armory, and a Big Jaws, one of my favorite shark cards. So far, this, this is like, I don't actually remember all I got, but I remember a quite big, um, some of it. Um, got an Elector Giga Weevil, which is, what, which is the whole reason why I want the building Zectors, because I got this card and Axe, and I fell in love with them with their design. Got another one. Got a fishing kicks for a goatee. Got, and we got two copies of the Sharktopus. Another really good card I like for sharks. Even though it's not, it's not really necessarily a shark card. It doesn't have shark in the name. Next up, we got a creature swamp. A weights and zen measures. Super awesome for um, wind up. Zubaba, Zubaba Knight. That's like saying the name of the Zubaba. The um, Anamana. Anamana archetype. I like tender names, especially Zubama Knight. Um, got a Aqua Jet for I think sharks I'm playing this in, and a Deep Sea Diva for my Deep Sea for Deep Sea Marinces Aqua Actress Water Deck. That's a that's a mouthful to say. Next one. Ooh, awesome! Yes, got Nash. Got Nash Knight, which I still needed for um, sharks. Got a Zen um, Zen Master, or yeah, Master and Zen. Uh, I don't know how to pronounce these names. Sorry, but yes, something I need for sharks for wind up and sharks and wind up stuff. Super awesome. Next one we got card destruction for uh, I think T Elements. I think I'm playing this in, or I need it for something. I don't remember what I think it was. Pot of because I never owned one, and one DFP, which I like to select the card. Super awesome. Uh, next one. Oh, sweet. Got a Butterfly Mantis. You know it's fake, but I like the way it looks. Got a Destiny Plasma for my Destiny deck. And it's a, um, from El Dorado. Super awesome. Got um, Lana the Light Charmer and Familiar Princess Area from my Charmer collection. Super awesome. Next, we got. H Heated Heart. Got three, four of them. Super awesome. I'm trying to spell the word hero. 
because I have um, resolved um, Hero Flash once before and still lost the duel. So, you know, super awesome. Next, we got my favorite artwork of Cyber and Dragon, the dark one. Super awesome. Got a storming wind. This cost really thick. It feels like really, really thick. Got a storming wind. Got a nightmare penguin, which I need for penguin. Um, penguin kaiju. Got a boss rush for BS, and we got an elemental hero poison rose. Super awesome. I did get some elemental stuff that I just wanted for the collection. Next one. Oh, there it goes. Next one, we got Hero Flash, one of my favorite cards of all time. Got a fake hero, I like this card a lot too, I like the artwork of it. Got an artwork is Justice, another one, and another one, a plus out of it, cool. I'm probably gonna play these cards in my actual deck, except for probably fake hero, but I like the way that I like having them around. And a binder to spell the word hero. Then we got one of my favorite elementary cards of all time, uh, one of my favorite elementary hero cards, Hero Signal. It's hot, it's super rare. Super awesome. Um, got an Elemental Hero Neo's Alias. Elemental Hero Hobo Heat, which is super awesome. Voltic, I like the, these two together. And then my one of my favorite fusions is Mutt Ball Man. My favorite Elemental Hero Fusion is Elemental Hero Steam Healer, in case you're wondering. Steam Healer, and then some of the dis um there's a Neo's Fusion I like also. Then we got a Book of Moon Platinum Rare from um, Nobody Nights at the Round Table, which I really want that set um, sealed. If I can get that set sealed, that'd be super awesome to have. And then we have uh, Um the Hero Inferno, which is super awesome. I really want to draw this card at some point. I do plan on drawing it eventually, uploading to my other to my um my art channel. I plan on drawing like not all the Elemental Heroes, but like most of them. Are the ones that I really enjoy. I plan on drawing it at some point. So if you want to see that, go subscribe to Galactic Art. We have a Deep Sea Diva, which I also need for my Marenta's deck. Marenta's um, Deep Sea Aqua Actress deck. Next is Unchained Abomination for my Unchained deck that I'm still working on. Super awesome. Um, last two. You got eight Instant Contact, which I super needed for my um, Neo's deck. Super awesome. Also, by the way, none of these cards are for trade because I am going to use all these cards for something. Just so you guys know. And the most prized thing in this whole lot is a signed copy of God God Magician, which is super wanted. And it's ultimate rare too. I really want this card. I've been wanting this card for like a while, but I never got around to buying it. And all my friends had like I think like a few of my friends had it in high school, and I really want this card, so I finally got one. And I got it signed by him, by Raymond. Super awesome. Next we have a Dark Dark Charmer, which he also signed up there. If you can't see it, it's like right there. Super awesome. Add this also to my um sign card collection. And we have a power tool, Braver Dragon, which I kinda wish I got signed by him, but I forgot to get I forgot to tell him about that. Super awesome. But um that's it for today's video. Um this will be the last video you see for me. With actual physical cards, so sorry about that. I'm back in October. But if you like the video, if you like the content, remember to like the video, subscribe to the channel, comment down below something. If you want to see something, send it to my PO box. And until next time, this is Jackson signing off.